Welcome, everyone. Thanks so much for joining us in this live stream. I'm here joined by... Hi, it's Corey. Thanks for being here this afternoon. Yeah, we really appreciate it. So in this live stream, we want to come back with you and share with you yet again another announcement out of Social Security. It's been a pretty busy week so far with them, and they're coming out with some other really good information here that we do want to bring to your attention right away. Just like that announcement, what was it, on Wednesday it was? A couple yep. days ago. Um, yeah, a lot of good stuff here. In fact, a uh, quick little side note, by the way, if you haven't noticed, a lot of information coming out of Social Security recently very interesting how this is happening and again in my honest opinion this is a good 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 thing going forward uh just in the last like what two three weeks or so we've gotten like, like three four major major announcements out of social security and likely many more to come this year as well so this is great we're not even that far into the year so far and uh some big stuff going on and we want to share with you right here on this video you probably noticed by the title 10 percent what social security announced well we're going to talk about the details of that which by the way i want to clarify really quickly no that is not a cola okay so i want to throw that they're really really fast so nobody says hey you said we're gonna get a 10 percent cola no that's not what we're talking about here okay all right so with that being said um should we do some shout outs really quick yeah here? we can actually we have clyde <clears throat> leonard moore eve santiago crystal c kiss my grits david daniel tammy coleman donna lewis ashley bell donna graham anita rutland ryan anderson awesome great nancy roberts sorry i'm gonna do some more yeah. um i'm sorry nancy last spot that's awkward melanie reedy um nancy rosen yvonne adams teddy murphy josh De davila Derek doc ennick gina zenzelber sorry about that um gabby rodriguez sasha marie bug baby nine karen ducker Derek crocker mark Cham chambin rudy the king roy burdrak rebecca Starr. thank you for being a member yeah thanks rebecca nancy thibodeau Tammy Coleman, Kathy Taverna, Kamla Shuri, um, Steve Dawson, Evie Miller, Sa Santos Dominguez, um, Morticia Dawkins, John Lynette, Sasha Marie, um, David, Dave Snyder, and James Benton, Nova Fenix, Trevor Leonard, and I love A. Leva. Nice. Chuck a luck. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> the list goes on and on. Yes, they do. This is awesome. <laughs> this is great. Thank okay. you. We'll do more shout outs. Yeah, but we'll we certainly just, do more here just, in just a minute. You know. um, by the way, here, I'm going to show you something uh, following up, but um, I'll, I'll kind of ramble here for a second. And I'm going to show you something which I'm holding in my hands right now. Um, and we'll tell you how to get that for free if you want, by the way. So, all right. Anyway, if you haven't already. Yeah, if you haven't already. But um, we'll talk about that in a minute. Let's. All right. So let's run through the details on this. This is actually pretty exciting. Okay. So as you probably noticed, again, with the title, we said 10%, which Social Security announced. All right. So about, what was it? Maybe two weeks or so ago, the commissioner for Social Security came out and said, hey, I want to be coming forward with a plan here to figure out what we're going to do with going forward with these overpayments. Remember this whole overpayment issue that we've been dealing with for, I don't know, six, eight, ten months or something like this? Well, obviously, it's been going on a lot longer than that, but it's been in the headlines a ton lately, and I've been talking about it every so often. I talk about it maybe once or twice a month. I talked about it and um, give you the updates on it. But anyway, Social Security has announced, and this is actually uh, retroactive, so it's immediate, it's uh, effective immediately, retroactive back to Monday. So this actually went into effect a couple days. Beneficiaries are overpaid. Remember, generally, you get that overpaid says, uh, hey, yo, um, <laughs> we overpaid you, sorry, but we're going to take a bunch of your benefits away and uh, you owe like thousands of dollars, right? It's a rough situation. I've read story after story of all these people that owe tens of thousands of dollars. It's rough. I mean, I just read another one this morning, $22,000 somebody owes. Read one the other day, $58,000, $76,000, $122,000. I mean, seriously, crazy big numbers that people uh, are overpaid. Um, so anyway, uh, basically the old rules on this would basically do is they could garnish up to 100% of your benefit until all of that money would be paid back. Rough situation, right? So they basically say, hey, you're getting however many dollars. We overpaid you by X and we're going to take all your benefit away until we are totally repaid. Not cool. Okay. So one of these major changes and what Social Security is announcing here is that they're going to do one of two things. They're going to garnish up to no more than 10% of your benefit in the event of an overpayment or $10, whatever is greater. Let me give you a quick example here, okay? So let's just say that you get a $1,000 monthly benefit. If you're overpaid, the most they could potentially garnish is 10%. That'd be $100 a month. Don't get me wrong, 100 bucks a month is, um, that's, you know, serious money. That's like, uh, what, a week's worth of groceries or something for a person or two? So that's big stuff right there, right? But let's just say that you're receiving, I don't know, uh, 
uh, I don't ninety dollar payment. Okay, ninety dollar benefit would be very low, but um, it is a thing. Uh, some people do get that. But let's just say you're getting a ninety dollar monthly benefit. Okay, they could garnish up to nine dollars. That's it. Okay, ten percent of ninety dollars would be uh, nine dollars. Okay, that's the most they could take. So they can take uh, ten percent or ten dollars, whatever is greater. That's the new ruling on this versus one hundred percent. So even though we're thinking like, hey, oh wow, ten percent is still a lot. You're right, but guess what? The contrary is. 100%. So it's it's actually a, a major, major change here. And this is a good thing. Now, again, I know that this is not the case for everybody. I know that everybody has not been overpaid. And hopefully but, you haven't been overpaid. Yeah, definitely. You don't know. Here's the thing. Hopefully you are somebody who has not been overpaid or received one of these uh, dreaded overpayment letters. But remember, you may not know, okay? And again, take Which this is kind into of the consideration. Whole problem, really, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You don't know. That's why you're getting overpaid, and you're not like yeah. saying anything because you don't know what their new thing is that they're doing. Well, that's the thing is you most know? people that are overpaid don't even know. They're just getting their benefit, and then they get a letter one day and say, "Oh, hey, sorry, we've been overpaying you for the last five years." Well, like, and if what? you're getting overpaid, you like. Don't you think most people aren't going to be like, oh, it feels like I might be getting a little extra money. Honestly, I'm going to call Social Security yeah. and be like, hey, it feels like I'm getting paid too much. I feel like that's not most people's instincts because we don't know how the rules work. Yeah. Plus, I don't think people really know that they're getting overpaid. I mean, no, seriously, I would I really bet don't. the vast majority of people don't have a clue they're getting overpaid. Yeah, that's the thing, though. So, okay. So, and again, I'm, I know that a lot of people may not have this situation, which is awesome. You don't want to be overpaid. Well, okay. <laughs> it depends how you're looking at it, okay? I mean, obviously, you want your benefit to go up, but if it were to be overpaid and then for them to come back and say, you got to pay us back, that'd be a bad situation. You don't want that. But take all this information into consideration going forward in case you get a dreaded overpayment letter. Remember, I talked about this the other day. Two million people a year get these overpayment letters. It's a lot of people, 2 million a year, okay? They're sitting on $23 billion right now that has been sent out in overpayments over the last few years here, okay? A lot of people are overpaid. So even if you don't think you're being overpaid right now, you never know. Maybe one of us or a bunch of us are being overpaid. We don't even know it. And in the sometime in the future, hopefully not, we get one of these dreaded overpayment letters. Get what I'm saying here? So even if this does not pertain to you right now, just remember this information or, you know, whatever, just... Keep it in the back of your mind that, um, you know, they're not going to come after 100% of your benefit anymore if that's the case. Good. That's great. Make sense? Yes, it does. All right, it does really quickly, um, really quickly, I'm going to stop rambling for a second. By the way, uh, a couple days ago, I showed these bars of soap. If you want some, we still have a bunch left. A um, couple days ago, actually, it was last Thursday. So last Thursday, what, a week ago and a day, um, the video title was something like, It's Time, 300 Available. I don't know. Scroll back and check it out. If you want bars of soap, free, 100% free, okay? We worked with an Etsy uh, shop owner. Um, I don't know. We have a bunch left, like a lot left. So um, if you want free bar of soap, 100% free. If somebody down in the comment section, some meathead down there says, Hey, give me some money. It's not free. Don't reply. It's not me. It's 100% free. We already worked out a deal with the, uh, the Etsy person. Um, just go over to that video, watch the video, and uh, follow the directions I gave you in that video, and um, you can get bars of soap for free. So we've already sent out, I don't know, 120 or something like that, but there's a bunch left. So anyway, just want to throw it out there really quickly. I got these still sitting here on my desk. They smell good. So, all right. Any yeah, shout do. outs or questions? Uh, okay. Again, the, the title of that video, it's time... 300 available. It's something like that. It's from about a week ago, uh, Thursday, I don't know, like a week ago. Okay, check that video out. I gave uh, instructions in that video how to get one of these guys for free. So anyway, I just know we have a lot left, so I thought I'd just throw it out there in case you want to grab it. So. Okay, so I would just say um, we're not getting a raise. That's what not the video's about. Nope. No, no raise. Nope. Said that at the very beginning. Um, no. So just to kind of clarify, not a 10 percent raise. No raise. Um, there's no check coming. Well, okay. Related. What to, kind of check are we talking about? Um, Stimulus when check? are the checks no. coming? So well, I would say I, there are no. This isn't related to like a check coming, right? Yeah, but also, okay, just to clarify, your checks are not ending either, okay? Nope. No, they're not ending, but like, it's not like a new check is being yeah. sent out. Nope. It's just your, if nope. you were being overpaid and they told you we're going to garnish your wage, you're, we're going to garnish your check because we've overpaid you and we're going to take all your money. Now, they're only going to take, Matt, tell them. Yeah, 10% um, or $10, whatever's greater. That's what they're talking about here, okay? So this is one of the major four changes that the commissioner announced, what, 
I don't know, a few days ago, just a few days ago, they came up with this announcement. So about, I don't know, two weeks ago or so, the commissioner was out in an interview and said, yep, I'm going to come out with a plan here soon. Sure enough, a few days later, he came up with a plan. It was a four, uh, four-pronged four plan. Well, <laughs> not really four-pronged, whatever. There were four different uh, pieces in this plan as far as what they're going to do with these overpayments. And this is one of the really good ones in there, okay? So we just got this information a short time ago. And this was retroactive back to Monday. Oh, by the way, Monday a few days ago, by the way, the... Uh, was that the 25th, I think? Yeah, Monday. Um, by the way, they also said there, oh, okay, I'm getting ahead of myself here, sorry. <clears throat> when we're done with this, we will link the the um, the article right there with the press release from Social Security. You can read it for yourself. We will link it down below in the description of this video when, we're, um, when we publish this video here, when we're done with the live stream. We will put it down below in the description right there on the Social Security website. You can see the press release. We'll put the link for it right there in there. Okay, so if you're ever questioning it, you can read it right there on Social Security. And um, there you go. Uh, but another thing too is they mentioned there right in that press release that if you are somebody who is already having a garnishment more than 10% or more than $10, whatever is greater, you're supposed to call Social Security and have that adjusted. So if this is your current situation right now where they are garnishing your monthly benefit uh, because of overpayment, you're supposed to call them right away. The 1-800 number, we all know what it is. 1-800-772-1213. We've all called it a million times and sat on hold for way too many hours of our life, right? Um, but anyway, you're supposed to call them and they can uh, apparently adjust your benefit. So they take only 10% or up to, t um, sorry, 10% or $10, whatever's greater. Make sense? So yeah. Yes. Okay. Um, so people keep asking me like, send me soap. Um, can I put the link yeah, in for, the, for video? the video? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to put the link in for the video. You have to watch the video. It'll tell you what to do to get the soap. Yeah, again, Very clear. right here, two of them. Um, um, but I'm just I, looking for that link really quick. Um, just go to the studio. And no, I it. know. I, I was oh, doing it's, the wrong yeah, way. It's back like, um, uh, it's it's from last Thursday. So a week and a day ago is when I had the video out. Again, the title's something like, it's time, 300 available. I'm not oh, sure what else the is. title says. Yeah, okay. stick it in there. Sorry, I just couldn't um, find but it. But I would say this much. Watch the video, follow the instructions in the video on how to do it, okay? Um, but yeah. So pretty cool. I don't know. We have two of them. I have not used them yet. They smell so good. Honestly, I have them just sitting here on my desk and I just smell them every day. <laughs> so if Corey's ever wondering what I'm doing up here, I'm telling her, yeah, I'm making videos. Really, I'm just sitting here huffing soap. <laughs> that I'm sounds really, about right. <laughs> I, I'm really not, <laughs> but it sounds good. Yeah, here we go. So I'm going to just, um, I'm going to figure out how to do this, but it'll just take me one second and then okay. I will link the soap video in here and then that is how you guys can oh yeah here we go you okay know i linked it it worked so so you copied the link right? i copied the link okay, so, so every you can so click often, on the link yeah every so often just paste it in there again okay just because it'll probably get buried okay um but yeah just watch that video what were you yeah. gonna say oh uh, i don't think anything okay yeah so anyway we wanted to share this information with you this is great this is really good and again another thing too I want to say this. If this does not affect you right now, that's probably a good thing. That's probably a good thing. You don't want to be in this position. But if you find yourself in this position, now you know the new rules going forward. But again, I want to point this out really, really quickly. Did you hear me all of last year? Like the second half of last year, I kept coming out like almost every video. And I was like, hey, get ready. 2024 is all about you, the low income, fixed income. We're going to see some major changes out of Social Security. We're going to see some major announcements, all kinds of things like this. Guess what? We're not even that far in. We're Basically, as we film this video, what's today? Uh, March 29th? Yeah, very mm -hmm. end of March here, okay? Well, not quite, but very, very close to the end of March, right? So with that being said, we're not even that far into the year, and we're already starting to see major, major, major changes on Social Security. A couple days ago, on Wednesday, we saw um, that major announcement about SSI. Again, check out that live stream, the last live stream we had here, talking about the major adjustment to SSI. I don't know. They're on to something here. So Okay, I'm going to jump in quick because um, somebody is commenting about this over and over. Um, Rebecca Gensler is saying, because you're going to cover this, you literally are saying this right now. So you can only tax the rich, rich up to, to $250,000 and nothing more, but the low income you can be taxed and have to turn in the, to the government that someone gave you $10 in food. That sounds fishy. I believe your last video about that, like mm -hmm. the last live stream specifically addressed this. Yeah. That you do not have to claim food anymore if someone gives you food, correct? Yeah. So <clears throat> that is actually no longer true. Yeah. So Rebecca, that's a, that's a good point. Uh, yeah. Really good point there. But yes, that's exactly what I talked about in that last live stream from uh, Wednesday, two days ago. Uh, check out that live stream. Seriously, go back to watch that live stream. It was good information. Uh, we had the information hit. I did a bunch of research on it. I jumped on a live stream right away. Um, 
it, watch that one. I talked about all the details, but yes, that is what I'm talking about here. The SSI changes just two days ago, Wednesday of this week. Um, they announced this. They are removing food from basically reducing your benefit as an SSI beneficiary. So yeah, Rebecca, definitely check out that live stream. The last one I had out two days ago. Um, you'll find it right there on the channel here, the last live stream, and really good information. Again, mm -hmm. what I was just talking about right here is we're only three months into the year so far, and they're already, you know, changing us to more changes coming for SSI. They're changing Social Security. Good stuff, right? Just to, just imagine, what's the rest of the year going to bring? I don't know for sure, but I can tell you this much, more changes are likely coming, okay? They've already alluded to that. What it's going to be, I don't know. I don't know, but these are good changes so far. We've had, um, what, five changes to the program so far this year, just in the last, call it two weeks, and um, they're good. They've all been positive so far for the beneficiary. Okay, so good stuff, yeah. Yeah, um, I'm gonna do some shout outs. Yeah, okay? let's do it. I feel like, sorry, I feel like I've just been rambling, but um, like I say in my videos, I like to try to talk fast, just try to get through the information because I have a lot to say and um, get through these details. So anyway. Okay. I keep fidgeting with these soaps. You probably hear it in the microphone. It probably is very loud. <laughs> Sorry. Man. You got to stop that. I got to put those I'm down. Sure Sorry. I'm sure it's like just a super distracting. Okay. Cookie Schweikert, um, Eve Santiago, Joe Congilio, Deborah Chapman, HR, Bex, Lillian, um, Rebecca Gensler, D. Carpio, Lisa Yates, um, Cynthia Shepard, Lisa P., Shir Shirley Kirby, um, Bex, Barbara Brown, Mike, Eve Santiago, Casper Linden, Chris S., Stella Martinez, Barbara Brown, Don Whitney, Sanford Sawyer, Tammy Coleman, Mike Montorio, Joe Westfall, Fred Weber. Um, Lillian wants to know, thank you for being a member. Are we going to receive a stimulus check this month? Yeah, good question, Lillian, and thanks for being a member. The answer is no, no. Stimulus checks, definitely not this month, okay? No, not happening. Um, okay, um, I'm just going to quick say something just so that everybody doesn't keep doing this. Um, if you go to the link and you just type in your information to get free soap in the comment section, that's not how you get free soap. You have to watch the video to find out how. So if you yeah, do that, that's basic. actually not, that's not going to get soap. So if you do that, you're not going to get soap. So don't be yeah. upset if you don't get soap. Yeah. Um, you have to do it. You just have to watch yeah. the video. It'll tell you how it's super easy, super, super, super easy. But it's just that's not how we're doing it because we don't want people to leave their personal information in the comment section. Yeah. Please don't leave your personal information okay. in the comment section. So, Actually, I deleted have a to couple of stuff if you do that. Yeah. For I deleted safety. a couple of comments uh, a couple of days ago because of that. So we just don't want your, your information in the comment section. We it's would just, never ask you to do that because no, it's not safe. It's not safe. Yeah. Please don't do that. Okay. So I'm just, just reading through comments and just want to make sure we're on the same page about that. And I'll put the soap link in again. Yeah. Um, so watch the whole video. You know, after this video, click on that link, mm -hmm. watch the whole video. You'll see where it says what to do, and people are getting soap. So it is working, and we are working with our Etsy person, and they're really good. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, she sent out well over 100 by now. Yeah. Um, yeah, so definitely. Yeah, we still have some left, though, if you want. Um, definitely. Yep. Okay. But yeah, I gave instructions. It was supposed to be a lot easier than that. Honestly, it was kind of a headache trying to get that whole thing set up, but um, we got it going and uh, we had to take a couple extra steps than we planned on doing, but uh, it's still very easy. But no, please do not leave your personal information in the comment section. We just don't want that out there. It's not to be in the public domain like that. Yeah. We, we would never ask you to do that. No. Um, in fact, I said it right there in the video. I said, don't do it. If you do, I'm going to, I'm going to delete it in the comment mm -hmm. section. Okay. Yeah. And I, I did that the other day. It's not because I'm trying to be mean or, you know, trying to be like, oh, I'm, you know, going after this person. No, I don't do that. Okay. Um, I am trying to just protect you. Make sure your personal information is not in the comment section. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's it's what for like your safety, really. Yeah. Okay. Um, anything else matter? Should we, should we, uh, no. uh paste that, um, soap link in there again, or just, okay. You? I, yeah, I if you want, it it's not required. If you want, yeah, just if you want, if you want one of these for free, hundred percent free, you can. Okay, we're not trying to sell anything. We're not trying to get money. If somebody tries to ask you and say, "Oh, uh, you need to pay for that," no, you don't. No, you do not. One hundred percent for free. If somebody tries to get money from you to get one of these, no, wrong. Hundred percent free. Already paid for. Already paid for. Okay, hundred yes. percent. Yeah. So there we go. Yep. Okay. Well, thank you guys for being here. Yeah. Cool. So. Um, yeah, another good update out of Social Security. So, um, great. I feel like this is great. This is Social great. Social Security yeah. is like trying to do something nice. Two, two big announcements this week. I mean, seriously, mm -hmm. how many big announcements do we get out of Social Security in any given year? The answer is like 
three. <laughs> and seriously, it's very, very minimal. And most of those announcements come in October when we get the COLA announcement and stuff like that. Mostly throughout the entire year, we get almost nothing for announcements from Social Security. We got two this week, uh, one or two last week, another one the week before. Yeah, big stuff here, okay? I anticipate more to come. What it's going to be, not really sure. But either way, I'm going to continue watching it and bring it to your attention. So should we wrap it up? Yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate it. And again, if you haven't done so yet, make sure to subscribe down below. Uh, you know, subscribe to the channel. We're here for you every single day, no matter what. Watching all the details. And uh, yeah, thank you. Um, if you're watching the replay on this, leave your comments, questions, concerns down below. Otherwise, check out that video. If you want the soap, if you don't, that's totally fine too. It doesn't really matter. Um, otherwise, check out some of their videos here. Um, some other good videos this week. A lot of stuff going on. Oh, check out that live stream from Wednesday as well. We talked about all the details and the changes for SSI. Big change for SSI. And I anticipate another one coming soon. All right. Done? Okay, we're good. Okay, thank you. Yeah, have a nice day. We'll catch you again later. Happy Friday. And um, we'll see you again later in the next video. Okay, thanks. Bye-bye. Yep. See ya.